Good morning, good afternoon, good evening and welcome to the channel. Join me today on a short walking tour around the big Buddha statue in Phuket. This particular big Buddha statue is located in Phuket in the south of Thailand. It is an impressive 45 metre tall white jade marble statue that sparkles in the sunlight atop the Nakaird Hill. The official title, and I'll try my best to get this right, is Phra Futa Ming Mongol Akena Kiri. This is the official name of the Big Buddha in Phuket. And it is the island's most iconic landmark and a symbol of peace and spirituality. From the base of the Big Buddha, you can get stunning panoramic views of a big part of the island's south. So it's no wonder it's one of the top photo spots on the island. Some of the things you can see from the area of the Big Buddha are the beaches of Kata, Kata Noi, Chalong Bay, and in the distance there you can see Promthep Cape. The temple at the Big Buddha in Phuket is a working Buddhist temple with residing monks showcasing traditional Thai architecture. You can meditate in a serene ambiance or observe monks daily routines that provide an authentic glimpse into temple life. A common thing to do at the Big Buddha temple is to partake in activities like offering flowers incense and candles as symbols of respect and worship. However, that's done mainly by local Thai and other Buddhist travellers. Construction of Phuket's Big Buddha began in 2004, funded by donations. Its foundation is firmly anchored for stability against natural elements, which is very important due to its location on a hill where adverse weather is typical. The statue stands proudly as a reminder of the devotion of the local community. And as you can see, the steps leading directly to the statue of the Big Buddha is a very popular location for photographs and selfies. The Big Buddha in Phuket allows visitors access free of charge. However, the temple does accept donations to help with the maintenance and upkeep of the site. The Big Buddha is open from 6am in the morning to 6.30pm on the evening. However, you can freely explore the temple grounds anytime. When visiting Phuket's Big Buddha, it's important to dress modestly, wear comfortable shoes and carry water and sunscreen on hot days. Be prepared to take your shoes off if you want to go to the inside temple. Did you know that you can see the Big Buddha statue from quite far away as it sits on a hill without much greenery obstructing it? So, even if you don't visit the site, you will likely see Phuket's Big Buddha while travelling between Phuket's Old Town and Kata or Karam beaches through Chalong.
and this is the view of the Big Buddha statue from the side and you can get an idea of the sheer size of it looking from the bottom at the top. The best things to see at the Big Buddha in Phuket if you're visiting are the 45 meter tall white marble Buddha statue. You get to see the fantastic panoramic views. Engage in the temple visits tradition by offering prayers, lighting incense and making donations. Find inner tranquility at peaceful meditation spots within the temple grounds. Gain insight into Thai Buddhist culture by observing local worshippers. Capture lasting memories with photographs of the details and surroundings and observe monkeys going about their daily monkey business. Construction of the statue started in 2004 and was completed in 2014 at a cost of approximately 30 million baht and was sourced primarily from donations. It was built legally in a national conserved forest with the approval of Thai Royal Forest Department. The statue is dedicated to the late King of Thailand, His Majesty Bumibol Adulyadej. Next to the Big Buddha sits a smaller Buddha image made from brass, devoted to Her Majesty Queen Sirikit. And I do believe this is the, this is the very image just, just in front of us now, well, to the left hand side. If you do want to visit the Big Buddha statue while you're visiting Phuket, the easiest way is to book a tour with a, a tour agent. Other, other than that, you could catch a taxi, a tuk-tuk, they will take you directly there and you, there's plenty waiting for, to take people back to where they want to go to. Some people do walk up the hill and then catch one of the tuk-tuks at the top back down. So there are many, many choices to take. The exit is marked there to the right. There are, are a different set of steps to get down the mountain. Um, you're not supposed to go down the stairs where you came up. There should be a guard there who will direct you to the other set of stairs if you do try to go down that way. If you are staying in Phuket, traveling, visiting, or just passing through, or if you live there, I highly recommend going to see the Big Buddha statue if not for the, the amazing views of the surrounding area than anything else, then you've got the, the statue and the other, the other things to see. So it's well worth seeing. Thanks for watching until the end. I hope you've enjoyed this video. And if you have, please hit the like button and consider subscribing. Please look out for my other videos, which will be out very soon. And I will see you all very soon. Bye for now.